Hey guys, Trevor Seven here. Welcome back to another video. And today we're here at the Cardinal Bus Slot in Rings of Rods. I'm in my office right here. Had to get some work done. Only want to break, you know, paperwork, and whatnot. So I'm the only one here right now. But um, something that a lot of you guys wanted to see was an updated fleet tour. So I decided to go ahead and make one now that we're on winter break. Um, some things are still, you know, happening with the buses. Things are being changed and whatnot. So um, I'll tell you guys what's all going on here. So we're going to walk on up here, um, do a quick showcase of each bus. So, uh, let's see. Where are we going to start? We can start in the garage over here. There's my car up there. We're going to start in the garage. And in here, I get to park in the garage now. So bus 10 is sitting here. It's not broken. I'm just parking in here. So, one of my lovely privileges now. Um, in real life, 11 parks here, but, um, in games since, you know, I run the place and I, I wanted to park inside, I talked with, uh, Andy, who was our new mechanic, and he said, sure, so, here we are. Um, for anyone who does not know, Andy and Nate had swapped positions, uh, just because it worked out better schedules with, with their schedules and whatnot, so. But here's 10, uh, sister bus to 11, which are 2021 Thomas C2s. Um, so fun fact, and things are getting swapped out as, uh, you know, things are getting worked on as we learned these details in real life. If I hop on the bus here, well, one thing you'll notice, uh, the header is a little different. Obviously no camera system, nothing like that, but 50 equipment inside that got changed around from what we had before. Got yeah, Myers logo. Up here, you know, virtually, you know, it's the same thing pretty much. And then, uh, I got my seat numbers and what have you. Walk to the back here and notice that uh, my bus empty sign's gone. I gave it back to Andy. Uh, turns out 10 and 11 have child check. So we will be uh, doing that. We're playing that uh, come when we go back in, uh, later in January. But so that's a nice little feature that uh, we added. And uh, like I said, as of this time, also in game, we're still working on these things. So this isn't final. Uh, you'll see the final version when we get to Cardinal AM routes back in January. So um what you see here is not what it's gonna be finalized as. So same with all the buses. So we're gonna hop out of ten there. Um actually I think real quick we'll give her a quick crank up for you. So you guys can uh hear this. I don't think anything's really changed. But there we go. And there you have it, bus 10. Can uh, do that. Um, we get we got new parking brake sounds too on these ones. So that's what's going on there. There's bus 10 for everybody. There we go. I had to hop out of the seat. Hop on off 10 here. Next to 10 in the garage, we got bus 5, a 2016 C2 on paper. So, even though it's a 2014, because that's when we got these, um, on paper it's a 2016. Then walking outside, there's our maintenance ram over there. Um, let's go over here. Over here, we got, you know, main fleet. We got bus 7 here in the corner. Uh, 2016 C2, and a real 2016 C2. Um, here is bus 7. Got the Cummins ISB as well. A little bit different sounding because, uh, in, on the older C2s, the, the Cummins actually sounded a little bit different. So, we'll hop in here. Um, one thing about 7 that's going to be changing here soon. Um, uh, we're going to swap out these lights back here. They are now LED. So we're going to swap that to match the real life one. And the reason being is these C2s, all our 2016s are actually going to get it. Um, the reason being is the incandescents have, uh, or are, they're causing electrical problems with the buses. So, um, like, they struggle for power a lot of the time. And um, on top of that, some of these actually have melting problems back here where it gets too hot. So... I'll hop in here and I'll show you what I mean about it uh, cranking rough 
Walk through the bus here. Got a bus empty sign in the back. A lovely bus. All right, I'll crank it up so you guys know what I'm talking about. Gotta let it beep, do its thing. There we go. It spluttered a little bit there. But uh, you see what I mean? It's, uh, <laughs> it's a bit rough to uh, crank up. So, um, yeah, it's going to get those LEDs, and that'll fix the problem, hopefully. So that's what's going on here, but here's your Cummins, everybody. Here. Uh, hop off 7. Moving on. We have bus 30 here sitting in the corner. 2010 Thomas C2, same thing as uh, it's always been. With the Mercedes-Benz OM 926LA. I'm not going to start it up or anything. I'll give you a quick walk through. So there is bus 30. Sister bus to bus 31. And here is bus 24, the 2003. Thomas FS65, our last one. It's crazy how it's the last one. Um, it's got the Mercedes-Benz OM904LA engine in it. I'm going to hop in it in a little bit. So I'll crank that up in a little bit for you guys. Got our grill cover on it and everything. Got to have some cardboard underneath too to cover those holes up. It gets, uh, doesn't, doesn't hold its heat in very well. So there's... 24. Next to it is bus 6 2016 Thomas C2 uh, sister bus to bus 7 with the Cummins ISB 6.7 liter. Um, I'll show you what LEDs 7 and the other 2016s are going to get. Their 2016s have not been touched yet, but 7 will be getting here soon. Um, waiting for parts to come in. These will be the LEDs they'll be getting. That's what it'll look like on 7 and um, didn't tell you guys, but in there in the shop, bus five will also be getting these. Uh, we got those two coming, and then hopefully uh, the LEDs will ship sometime for 32 and 33. Um, we'll see when they ship, though. Um, 30. Speaking of 33, here it is, sister bus to bus 32, and technically five. Um, 2016 C2 on paper, obviously a technical 2014. Um, got the Cummins as well. There's the inside of 33. Stepping out of that. Next to that, we got bus 29, 2010 Thomas C2. It, it's not a sister bus to anything. However, it's very, 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 very similar in spec to 30 and 31. So here is 29. Again, this is just showing you guys what's all updated on these things and whatnot since uh, you guys wanted to see it. That's 29. I'll hop it in here. Just uh, step up in the bus, show you what's all happening. Got our lovely seat numbers. I love these red and black ones. They are absolutely my favorite. So we're going to step off the bus here. A little bit of a step coming off that Wow. Uh, next to 29, we got bus 11, sister bus to bus 10, a 2021 Thomas C2 with the Cummins ISB 6.7. And this one also has the child check. I've already shown you the inside of 10, but I guess I can show you the inside of 11. Same kind of ordeal up here with the child check system. Moving on, we got bus 28, a 2009 Thomas C2 with the Mercedes-Benz OM 926LA engine. Technical sister bus to bus 27, which was my old bus. I'll show you guys the inside here. Very similar to 27 for the most part. Got a little half seat in the back on this one, too.
Okay. So here is bus 32, uh, it's exact sister bus to bus 33 over there. Um, hopefully we'll be getting the LEDs sometime soon. And uh, it hasn't been cranked in a while actually, so we're actually going to see what she's got. There we go. Took a moment. She started running. Hasn't been cranked in a minute, so I figured I'd crank it. So we'll let it run for a second. Um, yeah, so this is 32. I guess I can pop out the stop sign real quick. There you go. You kind of see the incandescence over there. That was nice and quick on this one. So there's 32. Surprised it hold, held its air. Doesn't uh, need any new air build up, but there's 32. Okay, let's hop off the bus here. So next to 32, we got bus 26, which is a our only 2008. Well, technically, um, 2008 Thomas C2. Got the Mercedes Benz OM 926 engine as well. Um, as many of you guys probably know, it's one of our only, well, it's our only C2, it's our only bus now, as an air horn. Uh, it's got the gray seats, it's got the true old marker lights, and it's got a lot of rust. <laughs> but here's 26, it's also got stubby cross views, that's uh, what they used to have on C2s. You may notice a bit of a difference here. Here's your gray seats. All the way to the back and all the way to the front. Most the seat numbers are a little different too. So this is one of the, gonna be one of the other ones we crank up today. You guys get to hear the 926 in action. We got new sounds. So here it is. Bus 26. Cranked right up too. Wow. Uh, 32 is also a spare. They're chilling here at the end of the route bus line. Um, every single one of these other buses I showed you are route buses. Well, kind of. And I will explain that kind of in a minute. But let me show you our handies here. So you got bus 9, a technical 2007 Thomas C2. I guess technically on paper it's a 2008. I recently learned that, but it's got the old style doors. Very interesting bus. We bought it used, honestly, quite a few years ago. But it's a um, it's a, it's an interesting bus. It's got the Mercedes Benz OM906 LA engine. I will hop on up in her here. Got a different driver's seat too. It's got gray seats. So if I said 26 was the only one that had gray seats, I am mistaken. 9 does too. Walk through here. Come back. I'll hop in here. You guys can listen to this. It's also our only hydraulic bus. So it's been interesting. That's for sure. <laughs> One thing I do want to point out, a lot of people have been criticizing us saying that um, this thing, T2s don't make that noise when they start up, but we did our research and they do. So just want to point that out to anyone who wants to criticize us for that. But here we go, we're going to crank it up. It's a little rough. It's also a little loud, by the way. I apologize for your ears. We're going to Bring it in for a tune-up over winter break, and uh, hopefully it quiets it down a little bit. And here is bus nine, everybody. Bus nine. Get, I'll show you those doors in action. There you go. 
your single pane doors. Very interesting bus. Alright, I'm gonna save all our ears and shut the bus off. <laughs> so, coming on out of the bus here. Woo! That was a bit of a step there, wow. Um, oh, there's my car, don't mind that. Um, my Supra. But here is bus 4, 2010 Thomas C2. Currently, it's out of service, it's getting work done on it. Uh, 9 is technically driving for it. Uh, not sure when 4 will come back in service, if at all. Probably will be the spare for the rest of the year between the handy buses. But hopping on up in here. Got that vinyl seating as well. And then uh, you got your green seating. You got your first uh, um, ones with the seat belts. You got these last ones that don't. And then the first four got your little seat belt stuff, child seats, whatnot. Turn around. I will not be cranking this bus up as uh, it's out of service. So, whoop. There we go. Hop out of that bus. It's uh, definitely got <laughs> definitely got quite some use out of it. That's for sure. Um, so coming around here to our spares. Um, well, I say spare singular because um, I will be doing one of the transitions here. While I'm showing this to you guys, you got bus 27 here. Obviously, my old bus. For those who do not know, 2008 or try that again. Ha! Huh? Add add one. 2009 Thomas C2. With the OM926LA, I'm not going to crank it up, but this is my old route bus. Here she is, our glory, sitting here as a spare. So, hop on the bus. There's the interior for you guys. Another half seat, spin around. Come back up to the front and hop off the bus. So there is 27. Uh, fun fact, it's got little LED 4-inch brake lights back there. Look at those. And actually, whoa, hello. Want my head on 31's cross view. Um, these LEDs, those brake lights, uh, the reverse lights are also the same thing, but 27 obviously doesn't have them. Um, these brake lights are what is going to be going on the rest of the fleet. Did I say rest of the fleet? I meant the ones that were being converted. So, uh, the rest of the 2016s. I'm getting my words mixed up, guys. But um, this will be what's going on the 2016s when they get their LEDs converted. Found that out the other day, too. So, here is 31, 2010 Thomas C2, sister to bus 30. Walk around to the back here. And uh, was a spare. Technically, it's actually out of service. But work has been done on it, and it's going to be going back in service as a route bus. Which route bus do you ask? I will tell you once I get on the bus. <laughs> so we do need to do some shuffling around here, um, which is what I'll be doing today. Andy asked me to do it. Um, our wonderful seat numbers. Really nice seat numbers, honestly. Way more than I would expect on any school bus. But coming through here, um, 31 is going in service to take over Route 26, which is what 24 is on. So yes, 24 will be bumped to the spare line once we get back in January. 31 will be a route bus in its place. We're gonna crank it up here. You guys will get to hear this bus in service while well, just driving around. I'm gonna drive it around down to the bottom of the lot and then we're going to come back up here with 24. So we will do that. I'm going to back up a little bit so I don't hit 27. Hear that turbo.
Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and move 24 here. There's right, 31, nice and running. You got much needed work done on it while it was uh, out of service. Because uh, 31 got replaced by bus 11, for those who don't know. So we're gonna move 24 here. We're gonna park it in the spare line right where 31 was sitting behind 27 here. So we're gonna hop in here. This is why I didn't hop in 24 just yet. I'm a little short, but I just... Oh, there we go. Here's the inside of 24. You're going to see me standing there. I'm uh, def This is definitely me walking around, all right? But we're going to hop in the seat here. We're going to crank up 24. Move it out of our way so we'll park 31. Cranks right up. Park it right up here behind 27. You can hear a 31 down there. There's 24, it's new home. I will be taking these magnets off after the video. But um, it's not goodbye 24 just yet. 24 will be sticking around for a good while, so you don't have to worry about it going anywhere right now. But um, it is a spare once again. We'll be resting up there at 27 until it's needed. We're going to come down here and park 31 up. Kind of my bad for leaving it sitting over there. Excuse me, bus 9. Thank you. <laughs> We're going to walk back up. We're going to park it on up here. Okay. Let's shut these doors. Me back 31 up here. Slide right in here next to six and thirty. Road back up just a little extra here. If I can center myself. There we go. We're gonna park this thing up, shut shut it off. And there you have it. There is bus 31. It is back in service. Would you look at that? Now that everything's parked up, I got a little bit of work done too. Whoop! Hop out of that. There you have it. So now it is a full row of C2s. And that is, uh, <laughs> my, that's something. Looking down that line, seeing all those mirrors. <laughs> wow. But there you guys have it. You guys wanted it, so you guys got it. Took a little longer than I was expecting. I just decided to wait till winter break to do it but that is our i guess end of 2020 cardinal fleet update um you guys will definitely see the differences when we go back uh in january for cardinal am routes so make sure you tune in for that um it'll be at 7 p.m eastern standard time as i always stream um if i remember what date we go back um so in Cardinal, we will be going back January 8th uh, for routes. In real life, we actually go back to school January 4th, which is in a week from today. So, <laughs> But yeah, January 8th will be our 
first day back at Cardinal for AM route. So make sure you tune in then for the stream. That's right, stream. For those who do not know, I do stream. So there you have it. There's our fleet. So thank you guys for watching. I got to get back to work in the office. Got to finish typing up some uh, route paperwork and what have you. So I got to go take care of that. But thank you guys for watching. Um, hope you enjoyed the fleet tour, updated fleet tour. And uh, there will definitely be some changes next time you see us. So keep your eyes out for those. But until then, stay safe, take care out there. Um, happy holidays, and uh, as we're going into the new year here soon in a couple of days, happy new year. So, take care.